was like the most hurtful news I had ever gotten. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today, Kevin decides he wants, um, oh my goodness, Kevin wants seafood boil, so we're gonna go out, grab the stuff, and then make a seafood boil. It's like so gloomy outside, I think it's gonna rain. Look at this boy's car. Every time I'm supposed to come, to Kevin. It's really nice, gloomy, you know? It's just only you need to be. Look, look at that, why is the garbage on the floor? No, it's just not a garbage. This is what, majority of the times, you always see us driving my car because his car is always a mess. Like, yeah, they say ladies keep their car dirty, but no, he beat us ladies. We're gonna go out, grab the stuff, and then get back and start the cooking. So now, I really um, plan to come in here to get myself an SD card, but Kevin doesn't know that yet. He's about to find out when I want to go over to the electronic section and he's wondering why I'm not heading towards the food section. So, <laughs> let's go this way, this away, where is, oh, over here, huh? He's asking me already where I want, what I want. I want electronics. Oh, okay. I thought you were gonna get mad. Like, what? We didn't come here for that. I only want a scan disc. Um, what do you call it? Hi. Do you work yeah. here? Yeah. Well, can I get a, um, an SD card, a scan disc for my camera? Please, thank you. So, I need another one because I have some footage on this camera that's very hard to come off. It's giving me a warm time. And I can't keep like deleting it off, uh, so I just grab myself another one. How many stories you are looking for? Uh, 64, okay. I'll take. Thank you. And this is for the, okay, yeah. Perfect. 64. Oh, you have a 128? We do have 128. Are you gonna buy it for me? See what I like coming here with my man? <laughs> he wants me to go big or go home. What is that? 128? 128, yeah. And it's Candice, right? It's For the camera? It's Candice. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Candice. Same thing. For the camera, right? Yeah. Why does it look different? Now it looks same. Yeah. Okay. Now, this, if you are using for camera, you will, you just have to use this adapter. And if you are using for phone, you can put this direct. Uh, that one is for your GoPro. Oh, if so I want to put in a GoPro? No. Yeah. Yes, oh, okay. Yeah, I don't use it in my phone or anything. I really just need it for the camera. Thank you. Yo. And how much is this one? So, baby, tell me to get this one. We can pay from you right now, right? Or no? It's $39.88. Oh, and that was $34? The, 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 one with the 30, the 64 gig was 34? Yeah, that be good. Might as well. You know the thing. Okay, we'll take the 128. It's okay. I don't need to know the price of that All one. Right. I'll just take the. And it's a 4K videos, right? Yeah. Okay, perfect. Yeah. Thank you. Here you go, boo boo. Thank you. Hold it. Okay. Why? <laughs> so, so you're not paying? No, 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 no. <laughs> you tricked me. This guy goes, oh yeah, get the bigger one. Oh, pick it up for me, please. That's what I'm gonna get him to carry it. This guy goes, pick it up for me, please. And what do you know? He does not plan on paying for it. See? Huh? No, we can pay down there. But we just gotta grab the sausage here first and then go. Those are just the two things I needed here. So I need sausage and the SD card. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm gonna be here looking for the sausage. We passed the butter section. Where's the one that I want? We passed the butter section. Yeah, this is it, guys. 
chicken frankfurters. Sorry, it's not sausage. Now, why did we not take a basket? I always do this. Come here, and I don't take a basket. So we pass the butter section, and I sent him to go back and get the Grayley butter. So let's see if he knows. He's still empty-handed. Boy, Grayley non-salted butter. Um, here's what, well, these are salted. Salted. No, we need unsalted. Unsalted. Yeah. Okay. Oh, that's great value. I wanted the Grayley one. Grayley. Grayley, yeah. Uh, those are better. I like it. The salted? Yeah, those are all salted. Um, okay, try Just take the basil then. Get the basil. Non salted. Hmm? No, we don't want the salted. It's too salty. Get the Grayley over there. No, the basil, sorry. This one is soft. Oh, here. Grayley unsalted. We found one. Yay! Oops, sorry. So, yeah, I'm really, really hungry and I just. I don't think I can wait until I go home and make this little bar. So, I'm stopping at ugh, Walmart. I mean McDonald's because that girl can't do no better right now and I feel for something to drink and to snack on before I go home and make the food so I'm just gonna grab something very very small just to eat you know, before I go home and cook to eat a girl can't be hungry you know man girl gotta eat so I'm gonna buy something there we go, my junior chicken sandwich. So I sub habanero sauce in there. That's the spicy sauce that they have for the McChicken, you know? So yeah, please babe, take it easy. I saw this man grab a cart, but he refuses to grab the cart because of Corona. So let's see him hold everything in his hand. Be spiteful. What does it say? Read it. What does it say? I don't know. You can't read your own language, baby? You're lying. Yeah, read it. Can. Can. <laughs> Look at him with everything. Uh, who's calling you? How do you know? Hmm? Do you want me to answer? You're going to hear him speak in his language. Hello? <laughs> no, they closed. Uh, they don't have uh, the top food. <laughs> like, like, they don't let people uh, to do it in store shopping. Oh my god, he's just, because I said it, he's not doing it now. Uh, just say it like, suck it your language. Okay, no problem. <laughs> Okay, okay. Guys, I'm 100% sure she's speaking to him in Cantonese right now. Why are you an asshole? You didn't want to speak Cantonese. Move! Honestly, I'm probably going to be tired by the time I get inside. So, you're going to have to start cooking. Doesn't matter. What? treatment per usual because I deserve it <laughs> this Jamaican guy saw Kevin recording me and he's like star girl he probably don't even think that <laughs> you're my man <laughs> he's like what she got a, a videographer <laughs> or a photographer I'm that good right mm -hmm. my, my, my personal 
a videographer. I'm joking. My baby. Yeah. In these times, we can't take no check it out. We have to hand sanitize we on. Because this corona thing, it's no joke. I'm mean, not get vaccinated, you know, because me no one did in 2025. May I live my life. Here's my seafood boil that I make. And only because, you know, you, I love you, you know that, right? I do. <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah, um, Girl, please start eating. Eating time. Mukbang. Well, it's not really a mukbang, but. Okay, you want to say your grace already? Damn. We can say it together? Yeah. God is good. Yeah. God is great. Let us thank Him for this food. Thank you for the hands that prepares this food. And thank you for guiding and protecting us and keeping us safe. In your name we pray. Amen. Amen. <laughs> so, guys, for a lot of people who didn't know, I was pregnant before Alani, right? I was pregnant for Kevin. So, Alani was born February 16th of 2019. And before I got pregnant with her, I was pregnant and had a miscarriage on February 14th, Valentine's Day. I'll never forget, remember? I was 2018. It was crazy. Like Kevin and I were at the hospital. And he was holding my hand through everything. He was kind of giving me jokes though. Like while I'm there sitting out waiting for the doctor to see me. But I found out I was pregnant like, I think it was, I was two months or three months pregnant. I think it was going on three months. Three months, yeah. And then one day, um, I went to the ultrasound. Found out that it wasn't viable. That means, hmm? Why is it not viable? Why do you see that? It wasn't forming. It was just like a little dot. Like the blood was accumulating together to form the baby. It was outside of the uterus or something like that. So hence <clears throat> why I had the miscarriage. So the doctor told me that, you know, I'll be passing it in like a couple days or so. And it was like the most hurtful news I had ever gotten. Could be yourself. Well, so. so we wouldn't have known because it didn't form. Your nose is running, <laughs> but yeah, um, we lost that baby in February. Then we took a vacation later on the year. No, I think I got yeah, I got pregnant in February, March, before May. Three months after, I got pregnant again with Alani, but I didn't know. Because we took a vacation in June to the Dominican Republic. And then when we came back, I just started feeling like, you know, <clears throat> tired, like sleepy, everything. And then, you, you, you actually was the one who told me, like, you know, babe, take a test, right? You thought I was pregnant. Yeah, he actually, I was tired and everything, but I wasn't thinking I was pregnant. And he's like, you know what, babe, you're pregnant. I'm like, what? He's like, yeah, I think you're pregnant. And the funny thing about it is when we went to the hospital and I was having a miscarriage because I was at work and my stomach just started hurting me and I like all, like fell down and he had to rush with me to the hospital. <clears throat> and my nail tech, she's Asian, told, we seen her there and she was like, what are you doing here? And I was telling her that, you know, I'm losing a baby. And she's like, oh, don't worry, girl. By the end of the year, you're going to tell me you guys are having another one i'm like no <laughs> we're not supposed to have a kid like that's it and then we went on vacation in june came back and i started feeling tired like and everything and he's like you know what babe you're pregnant take a test and i'm like no he's like yeah and you bought the test didn't you mm. yeah he bought the test and came and brought it to me to check 
And then when I tested it, it's like, oh, we're having a baby. <laughs> And then that was the lobby. Yep. Okay, guys, thank you guys for watching. This is a little bit of our history. We have lots more, like how we met and everything. Uh, it was it's crazy. Kevin and I have actually been through a lot together. I guess that's why we're still so strong right now. And we have lots more to go through together. <laughs> but so yeah. <laughs> Shut up. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, hit that bell post notification button, and remember, we're the good ties. We bring the good vibes. So make sure you subscribe.